rock fellers had to do a new spot today with some curbs apparently with some curb guys so we'll see what's going on with that it's like the fellers is already out here probably won't get a lot of footage of me get some skate footage of the other dudes so let's uh, see how this goes in the town on the hill where the apples grow the church bells ring every hour or so I took a little walk just to see the ships coming in the sun rose up right above the highway black, blue, red, yellow, golden skyway it's like the day that Jump into the wind. I can't go back down to that These old muddy shoes keep on walking streets. Someone's bride by an Egyptian sheets. And a display. Yeah, like I guessed, I got no footage of me. And there's a few reasons for that. So I've always liked to be transparent on this channel, I guess you could say. Let's go with the first basic reason. It's because there was way more people there than I thought there would be. I mean, I'm used to skating alone. There, I don't even know how many dudes were there skating. I didn't even get footage of all of them because it was like groups, I don't know. But yeah, there was a lot. First and foremost, yeah, it was kind of intimidating. You know, I'm not used to skating around a bunch of bunch of dudes who, that's kind of their spot. They've been there all the time. It was weird. I couldn't even, uh, you know, I tried to board slide the curb a few times and I didn't have the camera up or anything like that. And man, I was struggling to board slide that curb. 
and those curbs are on a different level than I'm used to. They are slick. That was the first reason. It was it was kind of fucking intimidating, honestly. And nothing against the dudes. Like I didn't know I didn't know any of them besides like I think two of them maybe out of like ten. And they're all they're all super cool, super cool. So they were welcoming, introducing themselves, all that stuff. But I was still very intimidated. Second is I don't get the opportunity to film other people so I have this camera equipment that I've always like wanted to use but I can't use it for myself I need other people to film so I was having a fun time just messing around with some of my lenses and the settings on the camera and a lot of it might look like crap I'm no professional photographer videographer anything like that so I kind of thought to myself let's take advantage of these guys just skating this curb and like I said I didn't get everybody but yeah, I just really wanted to mess around with the camera, so you can see in some of the shots, they're going to be shaky, whatever. I don't even know if this stuff is intended. The lens and the kind of setup I had to film the way I was filming, it's all for fun. And it was all experimental to me, but man, did I have a fucking blast. Like, it was a lot of fun. And then even after I was kind of done filming, because those curbs, they're, they were intimidating. They were ice. They were ice and I didn't know how to deal with that. So on top of that and just being nervous, just being nervous, skating in front of all those guys, it got to me. So what did I revert to? Filming and then afterwards is flat ground because when I'm uncomfortable with like the curb tricks, which is pretty new to me, I just like, I get nervous. It's almost like my legs could be shaking as I'm rolling up to the curb. But with the flat ground, if I'm going for like, I don't know, random flip tricks, I feel like I'm in my element, in a sense. I was nailing it on the flat ground, you know? I didn't get any footage of that, but I was landing tricks that, like I did a backside flip. I haven't fucking done a backside flip in, I don't know how long. I did a half cab flip first try. Like, the three flip just came. Kick flips, fakey flips, like everything just felt pretty natural. And that part was cool because I was stoked on just everything going on. So it was a different experience and I, I, I loved it. I loved it. But yeah, I didn't get any footage of myself. So maybe I can get like a flat ground session in right after this little dialogue. But it's not going to be as magical. But we're going to try to get one in. I'm done. That's all this old dog has in him after work today. And the trucks are back. Back to the rest of this video. That's kind of how the, went, the, the session went down, you know? Super stoked. Happy to be there. I'm sure it'll get easier if I go more often. It's hard to do with time and the boys and stuff. If not, like I said, I like to be transparent and I was fucking nervous. That's what it was. And I had maybe no, those guys gave me no reason to be nervous. They were all super welcoming super chill. I'm going to keep going to these Sunday sessions. And until then, see you guys on the next one.